So today we're actually at a local school in uh, Toronto, Canada, and we're showcasing VR powered by Radeon. We are showcasing it to students and teachers, and the experiences have been amazing. It was an opportunity that uh, Kelvin Lamb, who teaches computers and math and science, got us into, and he was looking for a group of enthusiastic kids, and there's nothing more enthusiastic than a group of grade 9 kids. So what made me open to the VR demo today is that uh, I want the kids to be able to experience VR because we are talking about uh, current events in the uh, technology field and um, some of their school work has been about uh, virtual reality and how that's changing the world as we know it. I can see that this can relate into the classroom, especially in uh, things like mathematics, uh, drawing shapes and structures in 3D would be really helpful to understand how the system functions uh, as opposed to trying to hold up three meter sticks and showing X, Y, and Z axes. You put the Z axis. Z axis. Z axis. Z axis. Within two seconds of practice, I could pretty much represent any function that I wanted to on the board. Just being able to draw two different functions and see the intersection point and then be able to rotate those around any axis you wanted. Being able to visualize it that easily, that's something that I know from university. It took me a year or two to visualize that and fully comprehend it. So if they could do it in a class or two, I mean, they're already going to be 10 steps ahead of their, their teachers that had to do it the old school way. I wasn't really expecting any of this going in, and then when I saw it, everything was really nice, and it was actually such a good experience to see this. It's actually so real. All right, you want to look to your right a little bit, to your right, slowly, up to your right, more to your right. Oh, it's actually a ship. Yeah. Ah! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> no, it's okay. Yeah, if I had a couple of classes that were using VR, I'd probably be more engaged because it, it would be more fun. It would also be more interactive with the type of lessons and it would actually be really cool. If we had VR in our classroom, it would be amazing because it's a great visual tool. Yeah, if we had VR in our classrooms, it'd be really immersive and we'd be, we'd be able to understand a lot more. Well, at least I think so. We, we're opening up everything for the future. We love to talk about 21st century learning and we love to say whether it's like we're 16 years into it and we still don't know what it's like. This seems a natural progression of what we're doing and this gives us the opportunity that we wouldn't otherwise have. You get students now jumping into math class, you've got the top 10% that are full into it and try things at home. Then you've got 80-90% of that class that is just doing the math because it's there in the textbook and they have to follow that example. But if you're able to pull it into a program like the VR headset where they were generally interested and wanted to try it and were excited about it every single day coming to math class, just a lot easier to teach when everyone has a smile on their face and everyone's passionate about what they're doing.